life in prison for Abu Hamza al-Masri. A U.S. District Court judge sentenced the radical London imam in New York on Friday. Hamza was convicted in May on terrorism-related charges, including his role in the 1998 kidnapping of Western tourists in Yemen that left four hostages dead. Hamza has maintained his innocence. His attorney, Sam Schmidt, urged a shorter sentence. And I think that there should have been a sentence of a number of years to allow him, whether it's in his 70s or his 80s, if he survives that long in the Bureau of Prisons, to spend some time with his family. Hamza gained notoriety for his fiery sermons in London. U.S. and U.K. officials said he inspired a generation of militants. He was also convicted of sending two followers to Oregon to start a militant training camp. At his sentencing, the judge cited his speeches in which he justified killing non-Muslims and praised the September 11th attacks.